We're in the midst of a currency crisis. Our dollar is going down rapidly as we speak. It's because we have lived beyond our means. We can't afford the foreign policy that we have. We have to cut back. We have to live it within our means. We're defaulting every single day. That's what your prices are doing. Prices go up. They're defaulting on your money. So we need to look at the Federal Reserve system. The dollar is going down. The cost of living is going up. Our dollar today is worth four cents compared to the dollar of 1913 when the Federal Reserve took the charge. Up. And if you don't deal with the dollar, there will be no retirement for anybody. We're going to have chaos. And that is why you have to cut spending. That's why we need a new foreign policy. We find this, all this military activity overseas, it's bankrupting this country. We have this huge deficit. We're spending a nearly a trillion dollars with maintaining our empire overseas. So if we want prosperity, we have to change our foreign policy. We have to live within our means. That if we don't want to cut any of the medical benefits it's for children or the elderly because we have drawn so many in and got them so dependent on the government. If you want to work a transition, you have to cut a lot of money. And that's why I argue the case that this money ought to be cut out of foreign welfare and foreign militarism and corporate welfare and the military industrial complex. And the standard of living is going down today. But it's going down and the middle class is hurting because of the monetary policy. When you destroy a currency, the middle class gets wiped out. Poor countries don't even have middle classes. We used to have one and they're on the ropes right now. But it has to do with a fiscal policy, monetary policy and foreign policy of way too much spending. But it took a lot of years for us to get here. The people in this country have been begging for a change in direction and they haven't had it. It's time we gave it to them. All great nations come down because they extend themselves too far. The empire gets too big and they can't afford it. Just as the Soviet system came down, that is what's happening. We better wake up and realize it and realize that if we live within our means and with, it, with our constitution, we're going to be safer and more prosperous. We're broke. We have to do something about it.